How's it and Jack Tackers, and welcome back to another video for you guys. Today, I'm going to be counting down my top 100 favorite films of all time. However, in this video, I will only be going to my number 76th film, so make sure to watch the next three parts after this to see which films rank where. Now, remember, this is just my opinion. I haven't seen every film out there. These movies on this list are just some of my personal favorites, and it was extremely hard to make. However, I do love every movie on here in some regards, so I feel pretty good about it. But uh, yeah, let's just get on into it. Number 100, Wreck-It Ralph. This is a great heartfelt Disney film that I never gets old when I rewatch it. Number 99, The Blind Side. This is a really emotional yet inspiring film with some great acting. Number 98, Pitch Perfect. This film is pretty funny, I gotta be honest. And also, it invented the Cup song, so that's gotta count for something, right? Number 97, Where the Wild Things Are. This is a great adventure film that is uniquely shot and has heartfelt moments throughout. Number 96, Free Solo. This is one of the best documentaries I've ever seen, with some even better music. Oh man, the music is amazing. Number 95, Bohemian Rhapsody. Apparently some people really dislike this film because they think it's inaccurate, but to be honest, I don't really care. I mean, it's entertaining and pretty emotional, so I think it's great. Number 94, Merry Christmas, Drake and Josh. One of the few Christmas movies on this list, actually. I grew up watching Drake and Josh, and this movie is just as good as the show, in my opinion. Number 93, Kung Fu Panda. This is a brilliant animated film with some beautiful visuals and kick-ass action. Number 92, The Lost World Jurassic Park. This film is pretty underrated. I think it's one of the better Jurassic Park films, and it has some really good dinosaur moments. Number 91, Fifty First Dates. One of Adam Sandler's better films. This is comedic and dramatic at times. It balances the tones pretty well and is overall a wonderful movie. Number 90, Shrek 2. What can I say other than this is just a perfect sequel? Number 89, Short Circuit. I watched this a lot as a kid and it still holds up with its humor. Number 88, Bambi. A classic Disney film I watched a lot when I was younger. I still find it tremendously sad but amazing at the same time. Number 87, Ponyo. A beautiful anime film with a unique story. Number 86, Ghostbusters. This is an iconic movie with an even more iconic song created for it. It's just such a good movie. Number 85, Get Out. Jordan Peele did a great job of directing this. It's very unique and interesting. Number 84, Avatar. The visual effects aren't the only good thing about this movie, in my opinion. I find the story pretty good, too. Number 83, Dumbo, 1941. This was a classic for me when I was growing up, and I still enjoy it. Number 82, The Jungle Book, 1967. Another Disney film that is just so iconic. Number 81, The SpongeBob SquarePants Movie. This is so good. I, I, I really don't care what anyone says about it. Number 80, Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. Such an exciting adventure movie. Number 79, The Karate Kid. Inspiring and awesome. Number 78, Close Encounters of the Third Kind. A great alien flick. Number 77, Watchmen. Very deep superhero film that makes you think. Number 76, Superman. Great movie, great score. John Williams is a god. Anyway, that is number 100 to number 76 of my top 100 favorite films of all time. I guess you can try and do this down in the comments below if it's too difficult. I understand. You can just give me like some of your favorite films. Um, but yeah, if you guys like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. See you in the next one.